behind the scenes. All right, we're on. Coming at you live from Meta Yoga Edmonton. <laughs> we got Giggs in the house. Giggs is right here. She's teaching some power. Uh, and then Chapman, Krista, she's on her mat. Uh, gonna do some power. All right, enjoy and sweat. I hope you have a little heater because it's hot here. Hey, Dunks is in the house. Woo! We're on then. Hi, everybody. Welcome to your power hour. Most of you know my name's Mel. And we're gonna get some heat going here shortly. Welcome all challengers out there. I see you, I feel you. So first things first, Chapman. Child's pose. <laughs> Chapman is in child's pose. Perfect, so settle in, settle in nice and deep. Knees wide, toes touch. Forehead on the mat. Roll your head side to side. Iron out your third eye. Iron out any creases, any worries. Let them all go. If you haven't done so already, begin. Begin your ujjayi breath. That audible inhale, exhale. Especially if you don't have a heater at home, this is what's going to heat you up. Make it audible. Make your neighbors wonder what's going on. And as you settle in, things are going to start loosening up. So breathe wider into your chest. Expand through your rib cage. Get into the intercostal, so spaces in between each and every rib. The spine gets long. All five lobes of your lungs are starting to expand. And you're more than welcome to chill here for a couple more breaths or inch your fingertips forward. Get long in the arms, pick up your elbows. Like down dog, press your palms, spread your fingers. Shoulders, keep them plugged in. Long inhales, long exhales, sets the tone for your entire practice. Your ujjayi breath is unique to your yoga. Keeps you anchored, keeps you calm, and it gives you an opportunity to really get centered. A couple more, Krista. When you feel complete with this, rock on up into your into your cat cow. Excuse me. Shoulders over your. Uh, Wrists, you know those things. Hips over knees. Knees are hips distance apart. So rock through a few of your cat cow. So you're gonna light up your spine. The hub of your nervous system. Inhales, lift the heart, the sit bones. Exhale, round your spine, look towards your navel. Finish the breath as you rock through a couple more. Light it up. Feel your spine awaken. Press your palms, tops of the feet. Take one more cycle through. Come to a neutral spine. Zip up your low belly. Belly button in and up, Uddiyana Bandha. Tuck your toes, hips go high, down dog. And of course, take it for a walk, pedal it out, probably your first down dog of the day. Check in, see what's going on. How your body's showing up for you on the mat? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Notice if there's any stuck energy, any soreness, any places to really send your breath a little deeper. And then find stillness. Come into full on stillness. Full on stillness like you mean it. Hips high, heels heavy. Spread your fingers wide. The triad of your hand, thumb, pointer finger, ground. Roll your shoulders away from your ears. Audible breath in, audible breath out. Very nice. Walk your hands back to your feet, back to your feet. Ragdoll. Feet are wide. Yeah, nice. Opposite elbow, opposite hand if you like. Let your spine drape over your thighs. Traction, that traction pull on the crown of your head. 
One more. Walk your hands back to down dog. Walk forward, walk forward. Downward facing dog. Neutralize. And then walk your feet towards your hands. Ragdoll, second variation. Feet are wide. Different arm variations. You can take your hands behind, lace them over your pelvis, let your hands fall over your head if you are interested in a shoulder opener at this time. Mm, legs can be straight, they can be bent. Rock some weight forward, long neck. Release your fingertips towards the floor, big toes touch. On an inhale, lift halfway. Exhale to fold. Again, inhale, get longer, sit bones back, crown forward, exhale, fold. Root your feet, rise high to the sky, look up. On an exhale, dive down, forward, fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway. Press your palms, step back, high plank, high plank, begin. Begin to light your, the fire here. Bring in the tapas. Load the legs with lots of strength, heels over toes, belly in, widen the collarbones. Drishti just below your fingertips. Align with your fingertips just ahead. Next, exhale, lower chaturanga, elbows bent. Up dog or cobra. Nice, Chris, so downward facing dog. Three to five breaths, let that work on you. Let that heat you. Hips high, inner rotation thighs, toes light, heels heavy, soft behind the knees. Yeah, water knees. Take one more cycle with your ujjayi breath here. Come high to the toes, look forward, and travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, half. Exhale, fold. Root down to rise high, palms press. Belly in as you dive down, forward fold. Inhale, halfway, jump or step back to high, low plank. Up dog, open your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Settle in, straight away. No muss, no fuss. Feel your triangle here. Breathe in, breathe out. Make them long, expansive breaths. See your drishti between your feet. Stay, you've got one more breath. Ready when you are, high to the toes, look forward, jump or step to the top of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, fold. Inhale, rise, powerful legs, rise high. Exhale, dive down, forward fold. Inhale, arda, half. Jump or step back, your plank to low. Up, dog, open your heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. Check in with your feet, outer edges of your feet parallel to the outer edges of your mat. Lift through your arches, four corners press, even if your heels never touch the floor. One more inhale, one more exhale. High to the toes, look forward, travel, top of the mat. Inhale, lengthens. Exhale, fold. Utkapasana, sit low, fingers high to the sky. Now sit deep. Asana means seat, so sit down, squeeze knees. Rock way into your heels. Can you see the front half of your feet? Belly in. Reach high. Sit lower, Krista. Aha, uh -huh, lovely. I knew you could. Exhale, fold. Straight the legs. Inhale, half. She's holding out. Jump, step back. High to low. Up dog, open. Down dog, close. Right foot to right thumb. Warrior one. Press your feet. Rise your fingertips. Get grounded, earthy into your feet. Back heel press. Palms face. Front knee bends. Lift from behind your heart. Look up. Hands down. Flow your vinyasa. Full breaths in. Full breaths out. Downward dog. Other side weights. Left foot. Step forward. Warrior one. Inhale. Rise yogi. Stay, exhale, get grounded. Low ribs, knit. Descend your tailbone. Where can you soften? Where can you brighten? Maybe look up, last breath. 
and then flow low, hands down, move, one breath, one movement, downward dog four, rest, ha, side out if you need, let that go, simmer with what is, be in this moment, be in this down dog, forget what's to come, forget what's been, land your drishti, nice work. High to the toes, look forward, way you go, high to the top. Inhale, lengthen, fold. Uttapasana, sit low, reach high. Exhale, fold, straighten the legs. Inhale, halfway. All right, vinyasa, high to low. Up dog, exhale, down dog. Right foot, right thumb, warrior one. Press down, rise high, finish your breath and then slide into your warrior two. Nice. Warrior two, both feet press. Widen your stance. Spend some carpets here. Use them up. <laughs> Sit low, reach wide. Flip your front palm if you haven't already. Reverse your warrior. Top palm faces down. Strong legs, gather up the energy from the floor. And then windmill, hands through, hands down. Move your vinyasa, high, low, up dog. High, yes, down dog. Other side, left foot, step up. Press your feet, rise high. Finish and then slide in. Warrior two, front heel, back arch. Outer edge of your back foot press. Front toes at 12. Keep your knee, your knee on top of your ankle. Lower, Krista. <laughs> Flip your front palm, toss your armor away. Spread your left ribs. Come up and out of the right waist as you look back. And then windmill, hands to the mat, vinyasa. Rinse that away with breath, with movement. Downward facing dog for the win. Ha, ha. Yeah, keep that out. Yes, you can be so serious about your practice, but don't take yourself so seriously. Right heel high to the sky. Open up three-legged dog. So take a moment. Bring your knee higher. Flex your top foot. Spread your top toes. Bring them into the practice as well. Choose stay or flip dog. Nice. Right hand up and over. Reach. Look beyond your fingertips. Left hip higher. Yeah, nice. Four corners ground. Breathe. Easy in, easy out. Stay. You've got one more full cycle ujjayi breath. Follow your thumb. Reflip. Take downward facing dog. Take a moment. Take a breath. Slide forward. High plank. Right hand presses, heels to the right, Vashi Stasana, side plank. Options go lower, drop your bottom knee, lift your top leg, stay as you are. If you're staying as you are, glue your legs together, Krista. Yeah, or there you go. <laughs> Tailbone, move it towards the back of your, or your mat. Spread your toes, spread your fingers, lift high, look high. And then vinyasa, hands down, plank, start with. Move through. Ha. Happy only on two legs. Left heel high. Open up. Spin open. Knee high. Bend your top leg. Flex your top foot. There it is. And then ready when you are, flip dog. Reach. Lift from behind the heart. My hand is behind. Lift, lift. Breathe in. Breathe out. Right hip goes higher. Soften the edges. Follow your thumb. Reflip, reflip. Take down dog. Take it here. Slide forward to high plank. Left hand grounds, heels to the left. Vashisasana side two. Outer edge of your left foot press. Notice your belly. Two inches below your belly button. In and then up. Like make this lighter. Brighter. See your top thumb. Give yourself an opportunity to challenge. 
Where's your breath? Where's your drishti? And then move. Vinyasa, wash away. Rinse. Come back to down dog. Ha. Yes, lovely. Right heel high to the sky. Bring your knee to your nose. Crawl forward over your wrists. Inhale high to the sky. Kick high. Knee to your right tricep. Stay or fly for three or two. And one, kick high. Knee back to your nose. Stay here for three. For two, now look forward, step forward, crescent lunge. Back heel on top of toes, fingertips swim high. Yeah. Once you land your position, your posture, then you can start to fine tune. Right hip back, left hip forward. Zip up your back legs, draw, muscle to bone. Back heel cat behind, now park it on top of your toes. Hands to heart. Inhale, lean forward, exhale, twist to the right. Left arm, right thigh. Yogi's choice, hands at heart. Open, take a bind. Lots of ways to play. No one can see you. Bust it out, try something new. Lengthen on an inhale, twist on an exhale. Fire up the back leg, that's your anchor. There it is, I saw that, that was beautiful. One more. Use an exhale, purposely open up. Again, warrior two, warrior two. Find your foot and start from the ground. Work your way up. Foundation is key. Belly, Uyana Banda, reach fingertip to fingertip. Crown the head to the tail of your tip, tip of your tailbone. Pars Mukhanasana, side angle. Come high to the front thigh, find the floor. Reach over top your ear, your top ear. Top palm faces down. Go to your depth. Go to your edge. And then tap back into the breath and kind of worm your way through the posture a little bit more. Lengthen, belly in, look up over your shoulder. And then listen close, look down, right hand reaches forward, launch off your back leg for Ardha Chandrasana, half moon. Left, excuse me, right hand down, left hand high, lift, lift, strong, strong through your top leg. So more fire in the leg, Krista, that's it. Long line energy, heel to the crown of your head. Stack your shoulders, hips, lengthen your bottom ribs. Standing splits, hands to the earth, keep your leg high. Reach high with your heel. If you want to be fancy, bring your right hand to your right ankle. Find your drishti for balance. Stay, you've got this, no worries. Just standing splits and drop it. Drop it like it's hot yoga. <laughs> Feet hips distance. Scoop up your big toes, peace fingers. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Padmasthasana. Take rest. Rock weight forward. Hips over your ankles. Legs can be straight. They can be bent. What I want to see here is a long spine, long neck. Soften between the eyebrows. Release the toes. Toes back to touch. Inhale, lengthen. Fold. Root down, rise high to the sky. Drink it in. Exhale, dive down, forward fold. Inhale, Arda. Jumper, step back. Take your flow. Arrive in downward facing dog. Left heel. High to the sky, knee to your nose. Inhale, push high. Knee to your left tricep. Stay, fly. Use your core. Get into the core work here. Look forward, lean forward, high to the sky, knee to the nose. Three breaths, make them strong, make them powerful. Look forward, step forward, press and lunge. Work your way, ground up, floor to the core, muscle to bone. 
Light it up with breath. Feel the posture. Make it new. It is new today. And soften. Soften around the mouth. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> Hands to heart. Inhale, lean. Exhale, twist. Right arm, right, excuse me, right arm, left thigh. Same thing. Hands can stay. Hands can open. Binders bind. You do you. Get curious of what's possible today. Come into you with new eyes, new thinking. Breathe, long breaths. Two more cycles. Feed the posture with this energy of breath, prana. And then exhale, open up, spin open, reach wide, warrior two. Hello, warrior two. Find it again. Lift from the inner aspect of your back foot, the arch. Four corners press, like toes. Shoulders relax away from your ears. Two inches lower because you can, exactly. Side angle. <laughs> you always can. You're stronger than you give yourself credit for. Top palm faces down, reach. Lengthen your bottom ribs. Take whatever you took on the other side. Create symmetry, equanimity. Open your heart high, look high. Where can you go? Where can you soften here? Last two breaths. All right, you know what's coming. Look down, undo your bind. Left hand reaches, park it on the floor, on your block, your wine glass, that, all that extra toilet paper you have. <laughs> There's lots of ways you can use blocks, straps, all those kinds of things. Make them up as you go. Right hip on top of left, you can spin it open a little more. Reach high, spread your fingers, bottom toes at 12. Ha. Soft and relax with what is. Standing splits. Hands to the earth. Rise high, high, doesn't matter how high, but make it your height. Bring your heel. Press your toes to nose. Lift strong. Zip up your legs. And release. Padahasta. Feet hips distance. Standing on your palms. Stand on your palms. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Soften your knees. Rock weight forward. Give your wrists some a relief. Elbows can wing away. Nice. Release the hands. Feet come wide, toes turn out, yogi squat. Take a yogi squat. Yeah. Sit low, palms press at heart. Elbows into knees, knees squeeze back. Get tall, get tall, there it is. Widen your collarbones. You can even close your eyes and go in for a moment. Just Go and check in. Feel what you feel. See what you see. Stay or crow. Hands to the earth. Toes touch. Knees open. Park your knees high into your triceps. And this is where you got to trust your process. you got to have a little faith here. Hips come high. Belly in. Look forward at the line of your fingertips. Toes touch. Heels towards your glutes. Draw in strong through your belly, and then jump or step back. Nice, high to low you go. Downward dog for rest. Ha, ha. Come high to your toes. Jump or step to the top of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, fold. Root down, rise high to the sky. Dancers, right hand descends. Take the instep of your right foot. And stabilize before you mobilize. Find the ground with your left foot. Choose, make the choice to rise your right foot high. That will tip your torso. Left fingertips reach. Soften the gaze, soften your jaw. 
Lift, make sure you're breathing, connect all the parts together. Oh, so nice, Krista. Go for it, one more, why not? And then slow motion, hands to your hip, knee comes forward, open your knee to the right and take your tree. Whether your foot is high into the thigh, the calf, you choose, hands to heart, or whatever hand variation that really speaks to you, pour it on thick, go for it. Samastitihi in all postures, reach, but soften the shoulders. Grow tall, round four corners. Low ribs together, tailbone descends. Knee comes forward. And let that go. Shake off the leaves on that side of the tree. <laughs> and then here we go. High, high to the sky. Hands. Left hand descends. Pick up your instep. Ready to go on the other side. Bring some life to the toes, the fingertips. The corners of your eyes brighten your eyes. Ground down to rise higher. Open your heart. Go to your edge, just a couple more moments. Nice work. Hands to your hips, knee comes forward. Tree, other side, knee opens. Take your position, press foot into thigh, thigh back into foot, create the line of center. The hands stay at heart, press, press, press with intention. Drishti for balance. Smooth the edges of your breath. Calm any storm of the mind. Be this tree rather than doing it. I want to keep you here forever. It's just so nice. Knee comes forward. And release. Top of the mat. Here we go. Inhale, rise. Exhale, dive down, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, jump, step back, high and low, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Right foot, right thumb, warrior one. Inhale, finish the breath at the top. Exhale, into warrior two. Not a lot of time here, straighten your front leg. Kick your hips back, reach forward, Utita Trikonasana, right hand down, left hand high. Four corners press. Light up the leg. There's very strong legs here. Left hip wrap over top your right. Lengthen your bottom ribs. Like you're pulling from your back ankle. Come up, inhale. Hands to your hips, toes to the right side of your carpet. Inhale, get tall. Sorry, turn around. Sorry about that. Inhale, get tall. Exhale, hinge. That way. <laughs> it's my right, some less. Hands to the earth, inhale. Exhale, walk your hands between your feet. Then chatter on the arms. Long spine. Long neck. As you inhale, walk your hands forward, and then walk your hands to the front of your mat. Pyramid, shorten your stance, train track your legs. Inhale for length, exhale to fold, hinge at your hip crease. Drive down the big toe mount of your left foot to pull, to maneuver the left hip crease back. That's it, yes, love that. If the back heel isn't grounded, shorten your stance, for sure. Twisted triangle, right hand inside or outside your front foot, left hand high, should be left hand high, excuse me, right hand high, yes. Switch it up, Kristen. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you got, you flipped it, so oh, I'm nice. like really bad ones now. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> okay, hands to the mat. Let's get this side over with. Hands jump back high and low. Flow through your video.
and y'all are so washed that damn side away, sorry. <laughs> okay, other side, left foot steps forward, warrior one. So one breath, one movement, inhale, bring it high. Exhale, open it up, warrior two, widen your stance. Mm-hmm. Straighten your front leg, drive it, and then reach forward, take Trikonasana. Guide your right shoulder back, shoulder blade down towards your hip. That your breath is flowing easy. Don't try hard here. Wrap your chest so the breath comes easy. One more. Come high. Inhale, high to the sky. Hands to your hips. Toes come parallel. Toes, excuse me, outer edges of your feet come parallel to the front and back of your mat. Inhale, get tall. Exhale, hinge at your hips once again. Scoop up, big toes, peace fingers. Inhale, lengthen, fold. Use your legs to ground. Belly draws in. Elbows can wing away just ever so slightly. There you go, nice work. Give yourself some room, some space. Straighten your arms, look forward. Walk your hands to the top of your mat, pyramid. <laughs> Spinning! <laughs> Take your pyramid on the other side, yes. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay, no worries. It's just yoga, right? <laughs> And then twisted triangle, twisted triangle. Put your lower hand inside and outside the front. Reach high, twist. Keep it level, neutral pelvis. Shift your hip bones back. Weight in the back heel. Soft knee joints. Lengthen inhale, twist, exhale. See your top thumb for drishti. Hands down, move through breath by breath. Full inhales, full exhales, finish, and downward facing dog. Ha, ha. Slide forward to high plank, high plank. Load your legs up, power. Inner rotation, thighs high, belly in. Slowly lower to the mat for five, four, elbows in, three, nice, two, and one. Calm down, belly down, Shavasana, couple breaths only. <sighs> Feel your heartbeat, there you go. Breath move. All right, hands near your mid ribs. Fingers forward, elbows towards the sky. On an in breath, in the chin and chest. There you go, cobra. Tops of your feet are glued to the earth. Make sure the pinky toe is pressing. So strong in the legs and kneecaps lift. Wide collarbones. Take another breath in. Exhale, take relief. Let the arms go, let the legs go, the right or left, you choose. And really let go, all muscles let go. This is a posture as well. Learn to rest. All right, chin back to center. Place your fingers over top your boots behind. Inhale, rise. Chin, chest, legs. Nice. Get super long in the legs. Reach your toes back. Crown forward. Squeeze palms, lift palms away from your glutes. See if you can get your, your hip bones and your pubic bone to be the only thing on the earth. Come higher and release. Opposite direction to it. Yeah, shoulders, arms, belly, thighs, calves, feet, let it all go. Yeah, I like that. Side out. Let something roll. Chin back to centers. Those two options, of course, are still available. 
Floor low is on deck. Bend your knees, catch your ankles or shins. Knee problems, flex your feet. Inhale, rise. Rise with the power of your legs. So strong in the legs, it lifts your heart. Soften your shoulders away from your ears. Belly still, draw in. Softer glutes to rise. Great freedom in your pelvis. Half an inch higher. Off, there it is. And take rest, take rest, you. Take rest. Yeah, windshield wipe. Soften. You can even switch your gaze if you like to keep it even on the neck. Facing dog or cobra. Hands to mid grip. Tops of the feet press. Inhale, rise. Come to your full expression. Stay. Feel your up dog. Tops of the feet press. Straight, strong legs, kneecaps lift, thighs off the mat. And then next, exhale through the knees, over the toes, downward facing dog. High to the toes, shins, jump to your shins at the top of your mat. Sleeping hero, toes touch, knees wide. Take your fingertips behind, tuck your tailbone. Come back to your edge. Now your edge will feel different today. Use a block, use a cushion, grab, grab a pillow from your, your couch. A rolled up blanket can help support. Zero pain in the knees. Zero crunching of your left low back. And rest. Open the front body. Feel a stretch in the thighs, the quads, solus muscle, and bonus points for the heart. Open the heart a little. Straight spine. Grab your ankles, your shins. Use your elbows. Rise high. In Camel, camel, come up to your knees. Switchy switch. <laughs> knees. Knees are hips distance apart and so are your ankles. Tuck toes if need be. Hands in your imaginary back pocket. Like a string through your heart. Inhale, lift. Exhale, hinge. Hinge over your, your shins. If your heels are available, great. If they're not, great. It doesn't matter. The action here is on the ground floor. So ground your toes, your shins, your knees, as you lift up, up and over like a, a reverse candy cane. Lift your heart high, breathe smooth, as smooth as possible. As you come up, energetic squeeze of the knees, come high, exhale, take a rest, sit down on your heels. Let that soften. Mm -hmm. When you feel content with that, place your palms on the earth, step back, down dog, sort that out a little. Might need a little movement, a little rock, foot to foot. Come high to the toes, look 10 feet forward, belly in, sit bones, jump through, walk through, step through, Navasana. Bring your feet up, reach your fingers, palms face, toes touch. Zip up the inner edges of your lulus. Bring your knees together. <laughs> Reach, lift, open your heart high. Take low boat, hover your heels, hover your shoulders, see your toes. Belly in. I know, tough stuff, but you can use your breath to rise high. High boat, bring it out of the water. Calm, calm, calm the waves. Low boat, one more time. Low breath. Yes, all good for one more, and let go, oh, she's going to go up again, let go, Supta Baddha Kanasana, sure, 15 more, no problem, <laughs> Supta Baddha Kanasana, soles of the feet together, knees open like a book, hand to heart, hand to belly, or any other design you choose, and do take a moment, take a moment to close your eyes, Actually feel your heartbeat and your breath rise, your belly, fall your belly.
watches if thoughts, any thoughts go by, any thoughts creep up. Like clouds in the sky, just let them go. Helping hands, close your knees, close your book. Bridge, feet hips distance, toes at 12. Tailbone slides forward, lift hips high. We did all that work to open the front body. Now let's express it through your bridge. Slide shoulder blades under, hands can be laced, they can be grabbing ankles, hands underneath your hips. Press your feet so you almost slide your heart center towards your chin. There it is. Use the back of your arms to lift. And release, let go of the hands. Feet wide, knees knock. Let your lumbar spine descend. All right, choose. How did that feel? How did that show up? Want to stick with the bridge? Bridge it up. Wheeler's got a wheel. Feet are the same. Hands come up and over wide of your ears. Plant your palms, spread your fingers high to the sky. I love it. Bring a little more heat back into the body. Full breath in, full breath out. Heart moves forward, tailbone moves away. Chin to chest, come down, rest, rest. Feet wide, knees knock. All right, choose again. Bridge or wheel, set it up for success. Feet at 12, hips distance apart, hands up and over wide. Lift, inhale, rise, rise. Use your breath to be powerful in the posture. Strong legs. Pretend you're holding a block between your knees. Inner rotation thighs, still. Chin to chest, come down, Krista. Ooh, sweet release. <laughs> Only five more. Just in particular, it's a great opportunity, a great opportunity to ring out your spine. Ring out your practice, ring out your life. Wash away the excess, clear out the cobwebs. Stay in the present moment as you watch your breath go in and watch your breath go out. Your last one. Use your core to guide back to your center. Hit stop for a moment and then zoom into the other side. Find symmetry, find balance. One side will be different than the other. That's cool. Nothing to Particularly mind about. See if it's possible to get both shoulders on the mat. Mm. Notice the internal massage you're giving yourself as you breathe into the twist. Babies, 
soles lifting to the sky, hold onto big toes, piece fingers, hold the outer edges of your feet. And stay in the middle for a second here. I want you to notice if the tailbone is lifting, can you set it back down? Shins become parallel to whatever's behind you, the wall behind you, whatever's there. Now you can introduce some movement, the rocking, one leg straightened, then the other, if you so choose. And then knees back to center, grab your hamstrings, start to rock, roll up and down your mat, mini massage. When you're ready, cross ankles, vinyasa, vinyasa, move through. All right, down dog. Right heel high to the sky. Bring your knee to your right wrist for pigeon. You can stay in place, stay high, king pigeon, mermaid. Fold forward. Make sure there's something for your forehead to rest upon. Be intentional with your breath. Be intentional with your posture. Even though that we're starting to close down, there's still plenty to do. Plenty of yoga left. Press palms, straighten your arms. Left leg comes around for double pigeon, double pigeon. Yeah, for sure, shoelaces on. You can use some props to give yourself, yourself some relief if you feel tight in the hips. Stacking one shin on top of the other. Remember which one's on top? <laughs> you want to fold forward, that's, a, that's uh, an option as well. As you inhale, rise, undo your knot, step back, downward facing dog. Other side, left heel high. Knee to your wrist on this side. Right leg extends behind, heel directly behind your sit bone. What you did on the other side, for sure. Inhale as you rise, straight legs forward. Dandasana, feet straight, toes together. Sit bones, ground. So you can pull your fleshy bits aside. Inhale, reach high. Exhale, fold. Take hold of whatever is available. If you happen to have a towel handy, a strap, a belt, that kind of a thing that can be useful to help open the shoulders, widen the collarbone, collarbones. And stay active in this. The legs are strong. 
Close your nose. Is the breath still there? And even where's the drishti, even if you unfold it straight forward? Belly in, gain some space. Inhale, slowly rise. Let your head be last. Come into fish pose. So come back onto your elbows. If you want to use a blocker or a cushion here as well. Prop yourself up on your elbows, palms underneath your glutes. Straight legs. Lift, lift generously through your heart. Look back, tip back. Nothing, nothing to do here, nothing to fix, to figure out. The work is done. Time to reap the rewards, the benefits of your practice. Integrate comes from the word, the Latin word integra, which means to make whole. And hopefully that's what your yoga practice offers you. Wiggle your fingers and toes. Stretch, move, awaken. Bring your knees to your chest. Rock on over to your right side. And then with helping hands, come up to a nice, comfortable seated position. All together, let's sit. Hands at heart center. Thank you so, so much for coming out, for practicing. Thanks, Angela. Thanks, Meta, Krista, everyone involved. Thank you so much. From our hearts to yours, namaste.